what makes the C-130 one of the most reliable aircraft in aviation history, highly trained and proficient maintenance crews. Currently, Legacy C-130 maintainers receive advanced systems and initial crew chief training at the Field Training Detachment, located at Little Rock Air Force Base, the home of the Herc. The base's recently renovated facilities house some of the most effective maintenance system mock-ups in the C-130 community providing the highest standard in hands-on training for both our airmen and foreign allies. Currently, the Active Duty's 373rd Training Squadron supports advanced systems and initial crew chief training for both C-130J and Legacy syllabi. However, as the Active Duty transitions from Legacy to the J model, FTD instructor proficiency will become critical in the near future, reducing their ability to effectively train our Guard, Reserve, DOD members and international partners on legacy systems. As a result, the higher knowledge and skill level Guard and Reserve maintainers are known for will undoubtedly diminish and increase the burden placed on units to train their maintainers in-house. The 189th Airlift Wing is prepared and perfectly suited to assume legacy training at the 373rd FTD through a classic association with Guard, Reserve and international students as our primary customer. Our goal is to incorporate three legacy maintenance schools under the 373rd's roof. The Mission Ready Airmen, or MRA, for our pipeline crew chiefs. Advanced Systems Training, what is commonly referred to as FTD for our specialists. And thirdly, we would reinstitute the Maintenance Quality Training Program, or MQTP, which would allow pipeline specialist trainees to have core tasks signed off before returning to their home units. Our FTD instructors would embed with the 373rd, teaching legacy courses while utilizing their facilities and take advantages of opportunities provided by the 189th's flying mission. Our robust flight hour schedule provides an incredible resource to present course material through hands-on systems training. The launching and recovering of 10 sorties per day combined with consecutive isochronal inspections would enable FTD instructors to offer real-time training. The 189th already has CCAF accredited instructors on staff, an essential component for trainees earning CCAF credit hours. The volume and availability of these training assets is unique to the 189th, providing prompt and effectual execution of training, rather than burdening home units with trying to do more with less. Legacy C-130 units are quickly approaching a critical shortfall in our capability to obtain the highest quality training for our maintainers and in turn provide the safest and best maintained aircraft for operational use. Little Rock Air Force Base has the tools already in place to continue legacy FDD training with the exception of a continuous proficient instructor cadre. The 189th has the ability and experience to successfully fill that role. The Air National Guard, Air Force Reserve, and our international partners cannot afford to sacrifice mission capabilities and the professional development of our airmen.